savvy. Hey everyone, it's Kiki. Get ready to say hola to Spain and Ibiza, two destinations that are basically the life of the party, but like a really old, wise, and cultured party. Think of it as your cool grandpa who can still bust a move. We're talking ancient ruins, passionate flamenco dancing, beaches that could make a postcard blush, and enough nightlife to make you forget what sleep is. Seriously, who needs sleep when you have this much fun? Whether you're a history buff, a foodie with a penchant for paella, or a beach bum with a taste for techno, Spain and Ibiza are calling your name. And trust me, they won't take no for an answer. Imagine yourself wandering through cobblestone streets, the scent of sizzling chorizo and garlic prawns leading you to a hidden tapas bar. It's sort of like a treasure hunt, but tastier. Picture yourself on a sun-drenched beach, the Mediterranean breeze whispering secrets in your ear. Spoiler alert. The secret is to relax and enjoy. Think vibrant markets overflowing with colorful spices, ancient fortresses perched atop rugged cliffs, and the infectious energy of flamenco rhythms echoing through lively plazas. It's just like stepping into a live-action postcard. This isn't just a trip, it's a deep dive into the soul of a nation while on vacation. And yes, you can Instagram the whole thing. A nation that knows how to party like there's no tomorrow, but also remembers its roots with a quiet pride. It's like the ultimate balance of YOLO and heritage. It's a place where you can lose yourself in the rhythm of life and find yourself in the most unexpected corners. Just don't lose your passport. So buckle up, amigos, and get ready for a wild ride. This isn't your grandma's vacation. We're about to unlock the secrets of Spain and Ibiza. One delicious bite, one electrifying beat, one breathtaking vista at a time. Let's do this. Let's rewind the clock a bit, shall we? Hang on, it's gonna be a wild ride. Spain's history is like a telenovela on steroids, full of drama, intrigue, and a cast of characters that would make your head spin faster than a DJ at an Ibiza rave. We're talking Roman emperors who thought they were rock stars, Moorish conquerors who redefined cool, powerful monarchs with more drama than a reality TV show, and artists who changed the world with their paintbrushes and chisels. Start your journey through time with the remnants of the Roman Empire, these guys were defiantly the OG influencers of their time. Think colossal aqueducts like the one in Segovia that looks like it was built by giants on a caffeine high. And amphitheaters like the one in Merida, where gladiators once clashed and the roar of the crowd echoed for centuries. Talk about epic. Then, fast forward to the Moorish era, where intricate palaces like the Alhambra in Granada will leave you breathless with their beauty and ingenuity. These guys were the original architects of awesome, but the story doesn't end there. Oh no, it gets juicier. Castles like the Alcazar in Seville and the Royal Palace in Madrid, whisper tales of kings and queens, battles and betrayals, love affairs and political intrigue. It's like Game of Thrones, but with better food. It's enough to make your head spin, but hey, that's history for you. And we haven't even gotten to the good part yet. And speaking of history, don't even get us started on the art. Seriously, we could be here all day. From Goya's haunting portraits that could give you nightmares, to Picasso's cubist masterpieces that make you question reality, Spain has produced some of the most influential artists the world has ever seen. These guys were the original rebels. Their works are displayed in world-renowned museums, but also hidden in plain sight, in the form of stunning architecture, intricate tilework, and sculptures that seem to breathe life into the very streets you walk on. It's sort of like an open-air museum, but with more tapas. If Spain had a heartbeat, it would be the rhythm of flamenco. And trust me, it's got more rhythm than your average TikTok dance. This fiery, passionate dance form is more than just entertainment. It's an expression of the soul, a story told through the stomping of feet, the clicking of castanets, and the mournful wail of a guitar. Think of it as the very first emo music, but with way cooler outfits. Close your eyes and imagine this, the rhythmic clapping of hands, the strumming of a Spanish guitar, and then a lone figure emerges, a vision in swirling skirts and flashing heels. It's like a dramatic entrance at a party, but with way more flair. The dancer's every move is an explosion of raw emotion, a whirlwind of passion and grace. That's flamenco, baby. It's just like a soap opera, but you don't need subtitles. And where can you experience this fiery spectacle? Everywhere. 
From the intimate tableaus of Seville to the grand stages of Madrid, flamenco pulsates through the veins of Spain. It's sort of like Starbucks. There's one on every corner. Don't be shy. Let the rhythm move you. You might even find yourself stomping your feet and clapping along. Just try not to spill your sangria. And speaking of rhythm, let's talk fiestas. Because in Spain, every day is a reason to party. Spain is a country that knows how to celebrate, and they do it with a gusto that's contagious. It's like Mardi Gras, but with more tapas and less beads. From the tomato-throwing madness of La Tomatina to the running of the bulls in Pamplona, Spain's fiestas are not for the faint of heart. It's a reality show, but you might actually get hurt. They're loud, they're messy, and they're an absolute blast. So pack your party pants and get ready for the time of your life. All right, let's dive into the real MVPs of any trip. Food and drink. Spanish cuisine isn't just about stuffing your face. It's about living the good life, one bite at a time. The Spanish have this magical ability to turn every meal into a fiesta, a flavor explosion that makes your taste buds do the cha-cha and your soul feel all warm and fuzzy. Spanish cuisine is like a Tinder date that actually goes well. Fresh local ingredients coming together to create culinary masterpieces. Vibrant tomatoes, earthy herbs, and olive oil sizzling in a hot pan. These ingredients are the heart and soul of Spanish cooking, and they come together to create dishes that are as Instagram-worthy as they are delicious. We're talking paella, the Beyonce of Spanish dishes. It's a symphony of saffron-infused rice, seafood, and meats cooked to perfection in a giant pan. This iconic dish from Valencia is all about that socarrat, the crispy layer of rice at the bottom that adds a delightful crunch to every bite. It's the mic drop of the culinary world. Then there's patatas bravas, the bad boys of the tapas world. Crispy potatoes drenched in aioli and spicy brava sauce. This dish is a staple in tapas bars across Spain and is loved for its simplicity and bold flavors. The contrast between the crispy potatoes and the creamy spicy sauce is sort of like a culinary mosh pit in your mouth. And let's not forget churros, those golden sticks of fried dough that are best enjoyed dipped in thick, hot chocolate. Churros are the ultimate comfort food, perfect for breakfast or a late night snack. The hot chocolate is so thick you could probably stand a spoon in it or use it as a weapon in a food fight. But the true rock stars of the show are the tapas. These small plates of culinary delights are meant to be shared and they're the perfect way to sample a bit of everything. Tapas are more than just food. They are a social experience, a way to connect with friends and family over a variety of delicious bites. It's like speed dating for your taste buds. These small plates of culinary delights are meant to be shared, and they're the perfect way to sample a bit of everything. From the moment you sit down at a tapas bar, you're invited to embark on a culinary journey that takes you through the diverse flavors of Spain. Each tapa tells a story, a tale of tradition and innovation that reflects the rich culinary heritage of the country. It's sort of like reading a really tasty novel, from patatas bravas to gambas al ajillo, garlic shrimp, pulpo a la galega, Galician-style octopus, and tortilla española, Spanish omelet. The options are endless. And the best part? You can mix and match to your heart's content, creating a personalized feast that caters to your every craving. Each region of Spain has its own unique tapas, offering a glimpse into the local culture and traditions. It's kind of like a culinary scavenger hunt. You can find tapas bars on practically every corner, each with its own unique atmosphere and specialties. Whether you're in the bustling streets of Madrid, the historic alleys of Seville, or the coastal towns of Catalonia, there's always a tapas bar waiting to welcome you with open arms and a menu full of mouthwatering options. The ambiance of these bars is as diverse as the tapas themselves, ranging from cozy, rustic taverns to modern, chic establishments. It's just a foodie's version of bar hopping. Wash it all down with a glass of Tinto de Verano, a refreshing mix of red wine and lemon soda, or a crisp Alberino wine from the lush region of Galicia. These drinks are the perfect companions to the rich and varied flavors of tapas, offering a refreshing contrast that cleanses the palate and enhances the overall dining experience. It's like the cherry on top of your culinary sundae. And if you're feeling adventurous, try a glass of vermouth, a fortified wine that's making a comeback in Spain. Traditionally enjoyed as an aperitif, vermouth is now being rediscovered by a new generation of Spaniards who appreciate its complex flavors and versatility. Served over ice with a slice of orange and a splash of soda, it's a delightful way to start or end your meal. It's definitely like the hipster of drinks, 
old school, but cool. But the true essence of Spanish dining lies in the tertulia, the art of conversation and connection that takes place around the table. In Spain, meals are not just about eating, they are about sharing stories, laughter, and moments of genuine connection. The table becomes a stage for lively discussions, heartfelt confessions, and the forging of lasting bonds. It's sort of a live podcast with your closest friends. So grab a seat, order another round of tapas, and let the conversation flow as freely as the wine. In the end, it's not just the food that makes Spanish cuisine so special, it's the sense of community, the joy of sharing, and the celebration of life that comes with every meal. Whether you're a seasoned foodie or a curious traveler, there's always something new to discover and savor in the world of Spanish cuisine. It's a never-ending party for your taste buds. Now let's hop over to Ibiza, the island that's practically synonymous with electronic dance music and legendary parties. It's like Vegas and Coachella had a love child and dropped it in the Mediterranean. This Balearic beauty is where the world goes to dance until dawn, with super clubs that are practically temples to techno, house, and trance. Seriously, these places make your local club look like a high school dance. We're talking world-renowned DJs spinning sets that will blow your mind, lasers that could guide spaceships, and enough energy to power a small city. It's like a rave on steroids. But Ibiza is more than just a party island. It's like Mother Nature decided to show off. It's a place of stunning natural beauty, with turquoise waters, hidden coves, and pine-covered hills that offer a welcome respite from the beats. Think of it as nature's way of saying, take a chill pill. Think yoga retreats overlooking the Mediterranean, hidden beaches where you can escape the crowds, and charming villages where time seems to stand still. It's like hitting the pause button on life. So, whether you're a seasoned clubber or a nature lover looking for a slice of paradise, Ibiza has something for everyone. It's sort of like a buffet of awesomeness. Just be prepared to embrace the unexpected because this island is full of surprises. It's a just like a birthday gift, but with more base. But let's be real, you're probably here for the party. And who could blame you? And what a party it is. It's like New Year's Eve every night. Ibiza is home to some of the biggest and most famous nightclubs in the world, where you can dance until the sun comes up and then keep going. Sleep is for the weak. Think confetti cannons, pyrotechnics that would make a rock star jealous, and enough bass to rattle your bones. It's a total sensory overload in the best way possible. Thanks so much for hanging out with us today. If you've had fun or learned anything, do us a favor. Like, comment, subscribe, share. That stuff really helps out the channel. We really need your help in building our community. We release polls at 9 a.m. EST every day. You can find them on our community tab, a short video at 2.15 p.m. daily, and a longer type video every other day. We'd love to hear from you. Leave us a hello in the comments below. Also, you can check out the super links we have in the description for Savvy Travel Gear to help keep you safe on your next journey. Or if you prefer, you could simply buy me a coffee with the QR code on the screen or with the link in the description below. We are so grateful for your love and support of the channel. Remember to be kind, be gentle with yourself, and know that you are appreciated. Peace.